put in the rumination collars because we felt that uh, it was one way of helping with the identification of heat detection um, and it's certainly done that and plus also with the health status that um, uh, it picks up any of the sick cows as well with the with the measures the rumination of the cows and the activity and um, the great thing about it is that five o'clock in the morning I can, I can switch it on and I know exactly what every cow in the herd is doing whether they're bulling or whether they're cutting okay and so by five past five I've got a pretty good idea of uh, how, they're going, how they're going on. Okay because as you can see on the uh, graph for this cow number 32 uh, on the horizontal x-axis uh, you can see your, your purple line which is your rumination um, over a, f a full month uh, your green um, line is your uh, is your activity so for this cow that was bulling on the just off about 19th of November you can see the activity increased whilst rumination decreased from normal uh, and once the cow's gone off uh, gone off heat uh, it goes back to normal so that obviously comes up with a formation of a diamond uh, a few days later she actually had a touch of mastitis so the activity has remained the same uh, but rumination has decreased but once treated that's gone back to normal so you can actually physically see that your, your treatment's worked. Yeah. In terms of the actual numbers that we've uh, seen since we've installed, installed the system two years ago, um, carbon intervals dropped from about 415 days down to uh, approximately 395. Uh, we're working at about a 17% culling rate, so uh, we are managing to make the cows last as well, which is uh, always, always good, especially at the uh, time though, when milk price hasn't been very okay. good. Uh, one, one interesting um, thing we found that when we do the TB testing, uh, once we, we originally used to do it through the milking parlour, we found rumination fell off quite a lot. Uh, obviously, they found it stressful. Now we put in a new race a year or two back and we found the rumination didn't fall off. Okay, this cow, when we uh, going back a few months, she had a, uh, when she came to carving, um, it came up on the iPad as a uh, notification, uh, just with a heat whip, with a, uh, with a distress, carving distress. The rumination on this cow, uh, as well as the activity, dropped off at that period, uh, but it was over a prolonged period, about 12 hours. Uh, so obviously it comes as a notification saying that there's a problem. Um, in terms of what we actually went and did then, uh, we sort of feel inside just to check that the, um, the calf was okay. Uh, and when we actually found that, uh, she, she actually had a torsion and twisted, uh, twisted uterus, so we were able to uh, write it uh, there and then rather than waiting, say, another 12 hours when it could have been too late. Uh, from that, uh, we had a life effort, so all in all, went pretty well. And as you can see, she's doing pretty well now. So. Yeah. Yeah. Approximately about 18 months ago, I was on holiday, and uh, because the system is linked into um, the internet, the internet uh, router in the house um, actually emails you when uh, you've got either an issue with a cow's bullying or uh, basically a sick cow. Um, once that information had come up, I think it was on one one cow, uh, one of our best cows. Um, she uh, it, it said the rumination on the cow had completely crashed. Anyway, so a rat. Even though I was on holiday, I still rang you up to uh, just to see what was up with her, and it just it happened that um, she'd actually lost a collar. So even though I was what two or three thousand miles away, I was still picking up information on um, on individuals within the herd. I think that's that's the key is that having the confidence to that even when you're not, when you're not on not on site, you, you can still feel you're monitoring the cows um, constantly, really. I think one of the one of the great advantages of, of, of knowing your, your health status and your, your heat detection, it allows you to have more time to concentrate on other things. Um, so you, you've got you basically can focus on other parts of your business that uh, you know you, you need to concentrate on apart from just the, just looking for cows bulling and um, any any prob health problems as well.